J Drone here. So uh, after my first flight, I threw it in this bottom switch, which I'll show you. There. It says something on here. Let's get on something darker. That way you guys can see it. Um, first switch says manual mode, which is full gyro. Second sport mode, which kind of simulates acro. And third says acro, which I pulled all the way back on this stick and the drone flipped and then came straight down. Um, I don't know what that's about. I, f I thought it was going to be much like the whirlwind. Now, I believe it's because this propeller is jacked up, but we'll, we'll find out um, in case any use have the same problems. We're going to go down and out on the controller. All blades are spinning fine. All blades sound good. I'm throttling up. As you can see, we're not getting lift on this blade here. Um, we're going to go down and out. If I were to full throttle up, what it would do is it would lean over this way. Uh, so hopefully it's just a blade. We're going to find out right now if it's just a blade. We're going to take the screwdriver that came with it. We're going to take a little protective nubby off of it. We're going to go over here and get these screws out. And it'd probably be safer if we shut the quad down, but this should be a fairly quick and simple process. Okay, so that's up. Now we need to go into our bag here, which they gave you, bam, they gave you two of each. Um, I'm not sure if there's markings on it. There is markings on these. It shows you rotation and also there's a little B there. I don't know if you can see that little B, it says B. Um, so we need a B blade which this is an A blade, go figure. And that's an A blade. Sure, the first two I took out were A blades. So the next two better be B blades. Okay, so now we have a B blade. As you can see there, B blade, right right below my finger here. Um, and let's see here, just see how badly messed up this one is. Oh yeah, that's, I mean, it's night and day, probably why it's not giving it much lift. So. Let's make sure there's only one way to put these on. There is only one way to put this on. Um, and make sure. Yep. So we are going to go ahead and set this on there. Which maybe it'll sit on there. Maybe it won't. Let's see here. Maybe we'll drop the screws. I don't know. This is the first time changing propellers on this. We're going to turn this this way. That way maybe I could see it a little bit better. Um, I think I'm going to sink one of the screws to get one of the screws set. Put that in there. And we're just going to try to drop this on top of one of the holes. And as you can see, I got a nick out of this one. So I'm going to change all the props. We're not going to do it during the video. That'd be a boring video. But we just change this one which seems like it's completely bent out of whack i want to see if we get proper lift now yep that's all that's to it so there you go if you crash this hard you're going to want to change the propellers if you if it's lifting to one side that means this one's not getting enough lift um if it's lifting to this side, it's this one. And if it's lifting to this side, it's this one. If you crash, say you hit heavy here and it, it's just doing this, change both these out. I mean, I'm changing all these out. Uh, we're gonna discard the bad one because <laughs> obviously uh, that's so bent out of whack that it's not getting lift. But uh, hopefully this helps somebody. Uh, myself, I was a little bit scared and a little, not scared, but it's just like, come on, man. I just got this first flight and I broke it, which as you can see, we didn't break it. We just uh, temporarily had it out of commission. Guys, I'm Jay Drone. If you haven't subscribed, please do. And uh, again, Hubson Jet, um, pretty durable, durable drone. I mean, you can see the battery here. Uh, the battery, there's a little nick right there on the battery see right there this hit pretty hard um i'm gonna stay out of that acro mode because it's definitely not acro mode but it's also mode i'm not familiar with uh all right later